Hey everybody, hope you're having an amazing day. Back with another Chris Stapleton reaction. First, uh, people wanted me to react to Whiskey and You. I think I'm saying that right. I'm not seeing the title in front of me. I'm confused right now. Uh, the live version at the CMT Awards, but I couldn't find a video of that song by itself. This is a video with three different songs that he, he did in this performance. So I kind of skipped ahead. So, and uh, I almost had it correct at the first click. It started, and then I looked up the first line of the song. Now I know I'm at the right starting point. If there was a video of this, only this song, I couldn't find it. Maybe I didn't look hard enough, so sorry for that. Little minor mishap. Uh, but we're going to enjoy this performance. I've enjoyed all Chris Stapleton performances so far. Uh, I just did. Um, you should probably leave. That put a smile on my face. I still have residue. <laughs> uh, but, uh, you know, I, I already know the first line of this song. And it's probably going to be a little uh, different in tone. So let's see. Let's see. Either way, I think this is going to be good. That's a given, no, with this man? There's a bottle on the dresser by your ring. And it's empty. So right now I don't feel a thing. I'll be hurting. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know if uh, people watch all my videos. I don't know in which videos I've said it. I'm two and a half years sober. So this stuff always speaks to me. I'm not, I don't know. He probably didn't have an addiction problem like me, but it still resonates with me. But uh, he's seen the bottle. It's empty on the dresser next to her ring, but the ring is empty too because there's no finger in it. Mmm. Ooh. When I wake up on the floor, mm. then I'll be old. Yeah. Mm. That's the difference between whiskey and you. Ooh, waking up on the floor. Yeah, not not my proudest moment, or plural rather oh wow yeah he'll be hurting but uh it's the difference you know hangovers they usually pass um uh, being lovesick or a uh, heartbreak I, I don't really know the term that uh u.s people use for this uh a little bit of both i guess that doesn't pass as quick as a hangover This is a line that speaks to me because I've been saying it myself for years. And I know for people that don't have a problem with alcohol, uh, that's fine. That's fine. Enjoy it, man. Enjoy it. En enjoy the ride. I applaud it. I can't do it. The first, I I've done it for years, but suddenly it started to become a problem. But then you start seeing, you know, how accepted it is, socially accepted in our culture, especially over here in Belgium, where... Belgians pride themselves on making good beers. And they should, because they make great beers. World famous beers. But of course, when it becomes part of a culture, it's hard to avoid it. And if you are in the midst of an addiction and you see a store, bottles lined up, and anything, I could just go in there. I could just go in there. Nobody is going to say a thing. They're just going to sell me this. They don't know what struggles I'm going through. Yay, yay, yay. Jesus. My man Chris is taking me back. Oh, forgiveness. Well, that's something I came back. Hmm. Oh, sorry to pause it again. Yeah, you can buy the bottles. You can't buy forgiveness. So I'm guessing he's going to say now, like he did before, that's the difference between you and whiskey. Oh, 
Wow. Amazing concept again to, to compare those things. I love stuff like this. I love it. here one's the devil one's driving me insane which one of the two is it the parallels the comparison the ambiguity look how quiet everyone is and i'm guessing it's an award show that that are his peers that's the ultimate respect yo mm. a vicious cycle isn't it i'm lonesome so i drink and i drink because i'm lonesome or was it the other way around yeah man you you, you, you drink because you numb the pain but then you know suddenly the drink becomes the cause of the pain so what do you do you drink more oh man so many people are suffering from this and sometimes, you know, I think, how can I help some of these people? And, you know, I've done some things here in my own country. You know, I had a podcast for a while where I talked about my own struggles. I've written some books. It's fiction, but my own experiences are in it. Uh, this is all done locally in Dutch. Uh, and hopefully, you know, with some of the things I say in these kinds of videos, somebody can relate to just like they can relate to this music you know maybe that's a pipe dream i don't know i don't break down just to know that you're not alone if you're out there struggling right now you're not alone um that's not a solution that's not maybe helpful but it is comforting Oh, and bring it on myself It'll hit out of the blue That's the difference Between whiskey and you One's a devil I'm speechless. Oh, that's the difference between whiskey and you. Wow. Oh, my man. Next song is starting. Oof. I don't know which songs he's doing here. It's probably in the description. Oh, this was a powerful stuff. Hey, and look at this. It's like a whole community that we are not aware of on this side of the ocean. And that's amazing that the people come together um, uh, to celebrate their genre of music, just to, to unite. That's a beautiful thing. That's a beautiful thing. I would love to visit um, Austin or Dallas or, you know, 
something, you know, more of the, in the South, like in Texas, I don't know, Nashville looks cool to me. I, I watched a few YouTube videos. It feels like you're there with the people, right? Uh, I've been to the U.S. once, New York. That's a different ball game. It's It's been more than 10 years. It was 20, no, it was 09. On New Year's Eve, actually, 09 to 010. Uh, maybe that's too much information for you. I just wanted to share that. But I would love to go back one day uh, just to visit some other states because it's a beautiful country, yo. And it speaks to the imagination, you know. We are over here. People went over there to chase their dreams. Um, it's just fascinating, right? It's just fascinating. Thank you again for this suggestion. Uh, let me know uh, if you have any more. I would love to check out more. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, I will see you in the next one. Have a great day. Peace.